What if I told you that the brightest objects in the entire universe aren't stars? Imagine pointing a telescope at what looks like a faint distant star, only to discover it's shining with the light of a trillion suns. Welcome to the mind-bending world of quasars. Back in the 1960s, astronomers were stumped. They found these star-like objects, but they were blasting out radio waves like a whole galaxy. The truth was stranger than they could have imagined. These tiny points of light weren't nearby stars at all. They were billions of light years away, making them the most luminous things we've ever seen. So, what's powering these cosmic blowtorches? At the heart of every quasar is a monster, a supermassive black hole, billions of times heavier than our own sun. It's not the black hole itself that shines, but the cosmic feast happening around it. A massive, swirling disk of gas and dust, called an accretion disk, spirals into the black hole. As this material gets crushed and heated, it unleashes an unimaginable amount of energy, outshining its entire host galaxy. But the show doesn't stop there. Some of this energy is channeled into colossal jets of particles, shooting out from the quasar's poles at nearly the speed of light. These jets can stretch for millions of light years, powerful enough to shape the growth of entire galaxies around them. Because quasars are so incredibly far away, the light reaching us today started its journey billions of years ago. This makes them cosmic time machines. By studying quasars, we're essentially looking back in time, seeing the universe as it was in its infancy. They are like lighthouses from a bygone era, helping us map the structure of the early cosmos and understand how the very first galaxies formed. Yet so many mysteries remain. Why do they flicker in brightness? How do they control star birth in their galaxies? And what happens when their fuel runs out? Quasars remind us that the universe is packed with wonders that challenge our understanding and fuel our quest for knowledge. If you enjoyed this journey into deep space, don't forget to like and subscribe for more cosmic adventures. Thanks for watching.